Well, hello, greetings, church family. Matthew here. It's Good Friday. We're looking forward to gathering together at 7 p.m. tonight uh, for our Good Friday worship service. We're looking forward to having our brothers and sisters from Onikawa Bible Church come and join us. They're excited about that. So come on down. We want to uh, extol the, the majesty and glory of our great God and his wonderful son uh, this evening. Uh, it's a brief service, 7 to 8 p.m. So come along for that. And we look forward to, to joining with you uh, over this whole weekend. It's a special weekend. Obviously, we're really looking forward to Resurrection Sunday, uh, this Sunday at 9.30 a.m., where we again will come and worship God. You know, it is the, the heartbeat and very real desire of every child of God who's being born by the Spirit to come and worship God. And, you know, over the last months and even years now, the whole concept of coming and worshiping God has been one that has become somewhat of a challenge. We realize that we have sought to gather each and every Lord's Day, and this has meant for some that they have stayed home or gathered in various homes. And, you know, we have sought to acknowledge uh, that. And uh, whether that's in an email or uh, from the pulpit, we wanted to uh, acknowledge that that's a good thing for you to do. And all while our heart's desire is that we would all be back one day together worshiping the Lord here uh, at church. And so we're excited that we can begin to do that. We can begin to reunite as a church family. We can begin to regroup and regather. We are indwelt by the Spirit of God. The love of God has been shed abroad in our hearts. And so we have the very real uh, potential now to display to the watching world a supernatural love where we can, uh, by grace, uh, forbear with one another, uh, let love cover uh, things. We can forgive one another. We can acknowledge uh, areas where we've grown, uh, even where we have uh, sought to um, uh, put things right where we need to, because these have been difficult days, uh, difficult days for everyone. And so church family, as elders, we love you. Uh, as elders, we've strived to shepherd you uh, as best we can, seeking the Lord's wisdom. Uh, in this. And so we believe that uh, while not perfect, the direction that we have uh, taken the church and are moving in the direction we are is really God's shepherding uh, ministry uh, of, of this church. And so we take that serious. We love you. You're a beloved flock. You're entrusted to our care. We're just under shepherds of the great shepherd who's leading us all home. And so we look forward to gathering together uh, as one, uh, beginning really this Sunday, and then building on that each uh, Lord's Day to come. And so we also want to be mindful that there'll be some of you that uh, have this virus at the moment, that you're recovering from the virus, we're praying for you. And then there's others who uh, are choosing to, to, to stay uh, at home and, and, and uh, stay away for the moment because they want the virus to pass by the bay to a greater extent. And so we respect that. Uh, we encourage you in that. We want you to make decisions, uh, if it's in that context, that are most wise for you. And uh, we love you all. And so let's begin to, 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 to come together and worship our God who's most worthy. And uh, for his glory and for his honor, let's worship our God. We'll see you soon.